What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? This is Demo Storm, and we're here with a map showcase. Yes, it's been a while since I showed off one of the newer maps that people are working on, and this is Madagascar Evolved. So it's more, it's not exactly finished yet, but I like where it's going. These big open fields, you know what I mean? What we want in a building aspect of Ark. You know, we got a cool river, and we got the skybox. Holy crap. It kind of looks like my VR's skybox that you can do when you're doing tilt brush. But you got these, like, this river that actually looks like a river. It's very clean. You got dinosaurs on it. So anybody looking for, like, a single-player map, I could see this working. And he's even got the redwood already on the map, which is pretty sweet. I believe this came in fourth on the map competition uh, that they do their random competitions on. And what is that? But I thought I would walk through the map with you guys. I have not adventured as much. Um, I just looked a little bit, but I do not know what that is. What is that? Oh, it's the snow. So wow, that's awesome. It's like a snow cave. Pretty cool stuff. Well, that lagged me a little bit. Yeah, but this is the redwood it looks like, so you can be able to build. I have a lot of fun with the redwood forests. I believe it looks beautiful. And we'll be getting it on the center map very soon on my server, so I'll be very, very happy. But yeah, it has a lot of open fields. It has the forest that you may like. You know, if you're a forest kind of good person. I myself like big open fields over the forests. Um, you know, it feels like the regular arc map is way too mountainous. Like, no matter what, there's going to be a hill in the middle of your base. You never really find that good, good flat ground. There's like one or two places, maybe. And people usually go right for them, so you can't really have a choice. The fallen trees on the sand dunes. It looks like this is going to be where he puts the desert. But yeah, I think he's going for a Madagascar feel, but I'm not sure. I didn't really read, read, read into it. You know, I just kind of looked at the description. I was like, oh, it looks pretty cool. We'll check it out for ourselves because you don't want to spoil everything about a map. Like, people always want me to read really, really in depth. But why would you want to spoil, you know, the hidden treasures of a map? You know, I, I like to enjoy it just as much as the next guy. So we got our desert over there with the burnt trees. Let's see. Well, this is pretty cool. We got a little oasis kind of idea going on. And oil rocks. But yeah, he said it's not exactly done yet. You know, it takes a little bit of work to get a map done. Especially if you want balance and stuff. But it's cool that the dinosaurs are spawning. We got mammoths out in the middle of grass. Which is fine. I understand. You know, elephants in Madagascar. But look at this field. Holy crap. Feels good. Feels real good. Oh, there's our swamp. But he he the, he looks like he placed the trees pretty accordingly. You know what I mean? Not to make this area too. I guess if you want to say tree, you know, make space for people to you know chill on. And I'll have the link in the description for the mad. Um, that or you can just search you know maps right now, and it's like the third one in the workplace. Wow! Look at that. Oh, man. It's very, very, very pretty. You know, I, I would build a base across these. I'd get a mod that allows me to build on the side of cliffs a little bit easier. There's one that actually makes pillars that you can build in cliffs. Is that our swamp cave? That's our swamp cave. Oh, look at that. He, you know, good placement. It's it's a playable map. It's not like it's unplayable. You, you could play on it. You might not find all the dinosaurs you want yet, but... It, it is entirely playable. You know, I would even build out here. Like, to show you guys cool builds and stuff, I would build on this map. Would not be a bad idea. It's so bright, though. Let's see. We'll go with the Gamma 1.8. Yeah, make it look nice. And Gamma 2. There. Yeah, I have bloom quality off and everything. I always turn it off. It's part of the game. But yeah, if you guys have a particular map you want me to check out, let me know in the description, uh, comments down below. I was going to say description, you guys can't type there. And we'll check it out, because I, I like flying around these new maps. You know, I do have a server now, so, you know, we are playing the center, but who knows in the future. You're going to have all these maps. You're going to have randomly generated arcs soon, which will be sweet. Because you can only imagine going on a server and not knowing anything about a map every single time. What are these? Is this like him working on more of a desert? 
What are those trees? Look at this. Scorpions. It, this looks like a desert as well. Whoa, what's going on with the ground? Hmm. Looks like it needs a little bit of work. The ground's a little shiny for my liking. <laughs> Look at this, though. It's just pretty. Very green, luscious, you know, fields. Then you got the hills if you really like building on a hill. I don't know who you are. I don't know why you want to build there. But I will find you. And I will judge you. But yeah, that's that's the whole part of it. Um, hmm. Did we already fly around the whole map? Let's fly up. We'll see. Yeah, look at... You got some good play area for a single player. I wouldn't do it in multiplayer with a lot of people. You know what I mean? Everyone will be on top of each other for the best, you know, areas. And it looks like it's missing quite a few resources that would be, you know, compiled. Oh, waterfall, waterfall, waterfall. Must go see waterfall. But yeah, I, would, I wouldn't do a multiplayer yet. Unless you want to do it with, like, you and your buddy. Enjoying yourself. I haven't seen, like, a Giga or anything yet, though. So who knows? It looks like down there there's a little bit of an oasis as well. But look at that. That's pretty. This is where I would build on the side. Right there on the edge of the map. It's big and flat. And it looks in indorable. Indorable. Wow. I'm failing today, guys. I am sorry. I have just woken up. I've been playing way too much of Ark lately. Uh, you know, 4 a.m. nights. Trying to tame dragons and stuff. But yeah, that's how it works. Hmm. What is going on with that wall? Oh, it's just not rendering the water in. Yeah, so we got a pretty waterfall that gives me very, very bad frames. But oh yeah, the water looks nice. Does it go down? Oh, it just kind of... Yeah, a little bit of smoothing needs to be done, but overall a nice little map. Strikes always seem weird. That's a car now. See, I'm used to Anunnaki where the dinosaurs are like weird sized. All of them. Every single one of them. Weird, weird sizes. This Tyrannodon feels about the huge. Raptors look like they should be babies. You know. Just, oh, look at these trees. Alright, guys. Well, we're going to end here. Thank you guys for stopping by. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out the Patreon to get onto my ARC server. We're currently running Anunnaki, a couple more mods, and the center map. As always, guys, I've been Demo. Have a wonderful night.